Hai, salam sejahtera. Welcome back to my channel, Learn Malay Language and Culture. As promised, in today's lesson, I will be sharing on Malay traditional raya cookies or in Malay, we call it as Biskut Raya or Kuih Raya. When this video is made, the Muslim all over the world are currently in the end of the holy months of Ramadan, where the Muslim are fasting for one month and after the holy months of Ramadan, we will be celebrating Aidil Fitri or in Malay, we call it as Hari Raya Aidil Fitri. During Hari Raya Aidil Fitri, the Muslim community in Malaysia will prepare the traditional raya cookies or biskut raya in order for us to serve the guests that visit to our house during the raya celebration. There are many kind of kuih raya in Malaysia, but in this lesson, I will be sharing with you top 10 most famous kuih raya in Malaysia. Let us start. The first kuih raya is the Almond London. Almond London. Until today, there is no scientific reason or proof on why these cookies are called Almond London and not other city. But what important is, this cookie is made up of almond nut that is covered with chocolate and some means almond nuts are sprinkled on the top of the chocolate almond nuts cookie. So there you have it, Almond London. After Almond London, we have the Tat Nenas. Tat Nenas, or in English, it is called as Pineapple Tat. Pineapple Tat. It is a cookies that use pineapple jam as the filling and it can exist in two forms, either the roll shape or the flower shape. Tat nanas is very very delicious, especially when the pineapple jam melt in your mouth. After tat nanas, we have the cornflake madu, cornflake madu or in English, we call it as honey cornflake, honey cornflake. The recipe are very simple, all you need is cornflakes, honey, and some colorful rice to sprinkle on the top of the cookie. After conflict madu or honey conflict, we have the popia simple or popia mini. Simple means to not where you not the spicy means meat inside the popia. After popia simple, we have the semperit. Semperit is made up from the mixture of corn flour, wet flour, and also the custard flour. And then the mixture of flour is mixed together with eggs and butter. Semperit. Semperit. After semperit, we have the biskut suji or suji cookies that is made from the mixture of flour, ghee or in Malay we call it as minyak sapi, minyak sapi and milk powder to give the biskut suji the creamy taste. After biskut suji, we have the biskut sarang semut, biskut sarang semut where sarang semut literally means and hill and hill the taste of biskut sarang semut is almost similar to semperit but in biskut sarang semut we put essence vanilla in the cookie to make it more sweet after biskut sarang semut we have the kuih rose kuih rose kuih rose is a sweet crispy cookies with no fillings and having the shape of the rose flower after kuih rose we have the rempeye 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 is more like a crispy snack that is fried together with ground nuts and anchovies. Anchovies. After rempeye, we have the popia nestum. Popia nestum, where the popia is fried and then mixed together with nestum. And then we have the kueh batang buro. Kueh batang buro, or in English, batang means stem and buro means ugly. So kueh batang buro literally means ugly stem, ugly stem, where it is made from wet flour, rice flour, green beans, coconut milk, and eggs. Next, we have this cookie that is made from flour, sugar, egg, butter, white chocolate, and orange flavor. And the name of this cookie is called the Pinocchio cookies. The Pinocchio cookies. It is clearly written here, Pinocchio cookies, Pinocchio cookies, but I cannot find the scientific and proper reasons behind the name of these Pinocchio cookies. And not to forget, we have this roll oat cookie, roll oat cookie that is made from flour, sugar, egg, butter, and of course, the main ingredient is the oat itself, roll oat cookies. And last but not least, we have this raya cookie where I think the name of the raya cookies is very very unique. In Malay, it is called as suci dalam debu. Suci dalam debu or in English, it is the sacred 
indas, the sacred indas. Suci means sacred, dalam means in, and debu means das. It sounds like the title of Harry Potter's movie, Harry Potter and the Sacred Indas. So that is all the famous biskut raya or raya cookies in Malaysia. Which biskut raya or raya cookies that you think you like to have a taste? Kindly share in the comment section. If you love this video, kindly click on the like button, subscribe to this channel and share the link with your friends. On our next video, I will be sharing with you on Malay traditional clothes or baju Melayu which is wear by the Malay male during the celebrations of Hari Raya. With that, thank you for watching this video. See you next time. Terima kasih.